Well, this morning there are new state recommendations out for school bus safety. The changes come after the deadly school bus crash in Clark County in August. And our Carmen Blackwell is live for us this morning to break down the upgrades that are coming soon. Carmen, a lot of parents will want to hear this. Yeah, you're absolutely going to want to hear about this. Good morning to the both of you. 17 total recommendations were made on this list, and it was things like a crash data, also bus driver safety, and even recruitment, too, as well for you. Now, Governor DeWine put together a school bus safety working group, and that group surveyed more than 1,000 bus drivers. Among the upgrades being made, increasing driver education by mandating six hours of advanced safety training each year, providing funding for districts for bus upgrades, like adding external cameras and outside LED lights to make buses a lot more visible. Also enhance the penalties for drivers who violate traffic laws in school zones or around school buses. We're also asking the General Assembly to provide funding for better access to advanced training that bus drivers are asking for. One of the things that the working group really emphasized was the importance of avoiding these collisions altogether. Well, Maureen, one recommendation that we noticed was not on the list was, of course, a controversial issue. That was seatbelt.